In What You Do Is Who You Are, How to Create Your Business Culture, Ben Horowitz draws upon his considerable expertise as a venture capitalist and modern management authority to provide insightful guidance on establishing and maintaining an effective organizational culture. Horowitz is intrigued by the influence of historical contexts on behavior, yet he points to exceptional leaders who transcend their circumstances, shaping their eras instead. This book centers on answering a pivotal question for any organization. How do you create and sustain the culture you seek? Horowitz posits that culture is the mechanism through which companies make decisions, reflected in employee choices about resolving everyday issues, whether to opt for budget accommodations like the Red Roof Inn or splurge on luxury at the Four Seasons, or how much time to allocate to seemingly minor decisions. He insists that cultivating a purposeful culture is crucial, otherwise it will be accidental or misguided. To illustrate purposeful culture building, Horowitz highlights four historical models of leadership. Toussaint Louverture, who led Haiti's only successful slave revolt. The samurai, who wielded power over Japan for 700 years and left an indelible impact on its culture. Genghis Khan, the architect of the largest empire in history, and Shaka Senghor, a convicted murderer who transformed prison culture. Horowitz adeptly bridges these historical examples with contemporary case studies. He examines instances where the cultural techniques of these leaders were applied or misapplied by modern figures such as Reed Hastings at Netflix, Travis Kalanick at Uber, and Hillary Clinton. Additionally, he draws parallels between Genghis Khan's cultural inclusiveness and the leadership of Don Thompson, McDonald's first African-American CEO, and Maggie Wilderotter, who spearheaded Frontier Communications. The book serves as a comprehensive exploration of culture from ancient times to the present. Horowitz crafts responses to fundamental organizational questions, namely, who are we? He emphasizes that it's not about the values posted on office walls, nor the rhetoric at company-wide meetings, marketing strategies, or even deeply held beliefs. Instead, identity is defined by actions. Who you are is what you do, he asserts. Ultimately, what you do is who you are aims to empower leaders to undertake the actions necessary to embody the leadership qualities they aspire to manifest, thereby crafting cultures that attract and inspire followers. Through his analysis, Horowitz provides valuable tools for companies to comprehend their strategy and cultivate a thriving culture, ensuring they remain steadfast amidst both prosperous and challenging times. You can listen to the full audiobook for free or buy this book by following the URL in the description.